Cleveland, Ohio, 29. April. In den nächsten Stunden und Tagen erfüllen sich hier beim NFL-Draft Lebensträume oder Zerbrechen. The 2021 NFL Draft is now officially open. Let's get this draft started. Gut 500 Meilen entfernt in Charlotte steigt die Anspannung. In der Draftzentrale der Carolina Panthers. Links Teambesitzer David Tepper, daneben General Manager Scott Fitterer und rechts Head Coach Matt Rule. Sieben Runden. 259 Spieler wechseln vom College zu den Profis. Teams können Dynastien erschaffen oder daneben liegen. JC Horn, Cornerback von der University of South Carolina. Ein möglicher Kandidat für den ersten Pick der Panthers. Seine College-Laufbahn absolvierte Horn nur eineinhalb Autostunden entfernt vom Hauptquartier des NFL-Teams. Penay Sewell wechselt zu den Detroit Lions. Horn steht jetzt bei den Panthers ganz oben auf der Liste, auch wenn er selbst noch nicht daran glaubt. Die Panthers bekommen währenddessen erste Trade-Angebote für ihren Erstrunden-Pick. Werden sie darauf eingehen? What's up, Carolina? Come on, Rule. Come on, man. Matt Rule, come on. Ein guter Trade oder den vielleicht besten Cornerback im Draft? Eine schwere Entscheidung. I don't think Carolina is giving me. They ain't called yet. I think they would have called by now. They next. First guy we're going to talk about is J.C. Horn. Okay, J.C. South Carolina. Uh, you know, said to be a really good kid. I think he's wired the right way for that position. He's very confident. He's had his eye on the NFL from day one, and, and he's, he's been a pro down there for him. Been healthy, nothing off the field. You know, junior, three-year starter, excellent size, quick feet, fluid hips. Just a great skill set, day one starter. I got it at seven one. This kid has a unique ability in that he's got really good feet, change of direction, but his size also in the run game would really help us. He, he has all the qualities that we're looking for, so I had him at 7-1, he's the first day starter. Did he ever miss practice time or anything like that? Was he an everyday guy? Okay. We asked him about that. I asked him for injuries on the interview. He's had very few injuries. Yeah, I mean, he's a pretty clean guy. We all have conviction for him. Good. Cole, Cole, come here. That's Lisa and that's Kelly. Is that you right there? <laughs> yep. <laughs> Is that you, Dad? Yep, look at that haircut. Like Summy, you look like oh, <laughs> Auntie Summy. <laughs> Scott Fitterer stand 20 Jahre in Diensten der Seattle Seahawks. Die Panthers haben ihn als neuen General Manager geholt, um ein Super Bowl Team aufzubauen. So I took the job on a Thursday. It was your birthday on Monday. So I stayed a couple extra days. Didn't, didn't go back. I left it all on you to do. <laughs> you guys did it all. I can't believe it's all down here already though. Come on. Go. Go. She's like a stuffed animal. I think she sits there and sleeps and eats. Kind of like you, Cole. <laughs> Die neue Aufgabe bringt viele Veränderungen. Being away from the family was the, probably the hardest part. We started draft meetings and free agency right away. We had the Senior Bowl right away. So there was a lot to do in the first couple weeks. And I hadn't had like one minute during the day. It's like 10 o'clock at night and you're just finishing. And then you wake up at six. It's the same thing over again. You know, here we are, like, what, four, four days away from the draft, and it feels like everything's kind of coming together. Boom! Yeah. You nailed it. All 
All right, what do we got? Tell me every possibility we got up there and down. So we talked to Denver. That is a possibility of flipping nine to eight. We've talked to the Giants. We've talked to Philadelphia, New England, Las Vegas. And then uh, early on, two weeks ago, it was Kansas City. They've made moves since then. That's where two and one. That's too far back to go, I think. So should we run down through the board? Yeah, why don't, do do, that? Uh, why don't we let the uh, master go to the <laughs> chalkboard here. So. All right, we think one, obviously Jacksonville. We think Lawrence, right? Two, New York Jets. We think Wilson. Three, San Fran. We think Mac Jones, but there's, you know, or it could be Trey Lance. Four, Atlanta. We think Kyle Pitts. Five, Cincinnati. Sounds like it's going to be Chase, but it could always be Sewell. Six, Miami. You know, Pitts or Chase if they got there, right? And then probably an Alabama receiver. Everybody agree with that? Yes. Seven, the Lions. No one really knows what they're going to do. Possible trade out. Possible Sewell. That leaves us. So uh, that, that cluster of guys that we really love is Sewell because he's an offensive lineman. Horn as our top ranked corner. Sartain, Waddle, Devontae Smith. That's kind of the rankings. Is there anybody you guys that I'm forgetting? No, you have them all. All right, we should really go over, you know, different trades we can do. Yeah. We can do it today, we can do it tomorrow. No, we, we, can, do yeah, it, we can do it now. We, can, we, can do it. we shouldn't do it Friday, though. That would be okay. <laughs> that wouldn't be ideal. I don't think Carolina is getting me. They ain't called yet. I think they would have called by now. Hey, next. Hey, you walk away, we're walking away with the guy we said we wanted. Yeah, I mean, that's what we knew. Erster Pick de Pentos. Träume werden wahr. So make us move. Make us move. Hey. There we go. Hello. JC, it's Matt Allen, Carolina Panthers, buddy. We're going to take you right here, okay? Let's get it. All right, man. Well, I'm going to put you on real quick. All right, cool. It was good, coach. I told you last night. Hey, <laughs> let's get to work. You grew up in this league. Uh, you know what this is about, man. You know the responsibility. You know what we're trying to do. All uh, right, yes, sir. I'm ready. Let's do it. Here's Mr. Tepper, our owner. He's excited to talk to you. Here he is. All right. Hey, JC, how you doing? Hey, we're happy to have you. Yes, sir. I'm glad to be a part of the organization. We're tickled to have you here. Let me give you the GM here, okay? All right, cool. Hey, congratulations, man. We're so excited to have you. You're the exact player we need, the attitude, the, the play style. So excited. You go celebrate. Uh, we'll be in contact and uh, let you know what the travel plans are, okay? All right, cool. All right, man. Congratulations. Go have fun. All right. Yeah, JC Horn landet bei seinem Lieblingsteam und die Panthers bekommen ihren Wunschspieler. All right, let's see what they say. Here comes the commissioner to the podium with the Carolinas Panthers choice. Let's see who they choose. Eighth overall. Turn it up, turn it up, turn it up, turn it up. They're gonna announce it. They're gonna announce it. With the eighth pick in the 2021 NFL Draft, the Carolina Panthers select. J.C. Horn, defensive back, South Carolina. Yes, sir. You know what time it is? Yes, sir. Let's get it. Für sein College hat Horn die Wide Receiver der gegnerischen Teams gedeckt und überraschte als schneller Quarterback-Jäger. Kann er das zu den Profis übertragen? Nur 90 Meilen von seinem Campus entfernt startet der NFL-Traum. Die Erstrundenpicks fliegen nur wenige Stunden nach dem Draft zu ihren neuen Teams, auf Kosten der Besitzer. Das ist nicht selten ein Kulturschock. 
That was that private jet. That's where to live, isn't it? Yeah, it was a little scary though, a little bumpy. <laughs> I was nervous. I was nervous. I ain't gonna lie. That's your first time seeing that, right? That's been up there since last night. Yeah, that's tough. I seen it on a uh, social media, but damn. Love it, man. Show my mama, she might not get to see this. Auch viele College-Spieler sind Stars, aber das große Geld verspricht nur die NFL. Sein Sport und sein Talent geben JC Horn die Chance auf ein Leben in Wohlstand und Sicherheit. Horns neuer Chef David Tepper ist einer der reichsten Männer der Welt und begegnet jedem Menschen auf Augenhöhe. Talking about Mr. Two, talking about uh, you being a dog. I said he's literally ready to cover right now if he had to. Yeah. <laughs> Put notice clicks right Put now. Put him on right now, he can do it. <laughs> Der Rundgang durchs neue Wohnzimmer geht weiter Richtung Front Office. So, Coach. How are you, man? Glad to be here. Oh, glad to have you here. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hey, hey. Welcome, man. Yes, sir. Congratulations. Appreciate you guys. You excited? Got the dream come true. Man, I was so happy. You don't understand how happy. I got more calls last night. They like we got the alpha. Like we love that guy. Thing is, look at our defense right now. We have so many good young coach. I know. I can't wait. Man. Defensive line, crazy. We want your swag and your energy and kind of that toughness. That's that's what bring you bring. Day one, I promise you. I'm so happy to keep you. Appreciate you, man. Appreciate you, all Yes, sir. Eine weitreichende Entscheidung steht an. Die Panthers beratschlagen über einen neuen Quarterback. Sie haben Sam Donald von den New York Jets im Visier. He's tough. Like he cares about ball. You can see it on tape. Um, I like all that about him. The other thing I really like about him is the fact he's going to be so young compared to the other guys that are available. And even this draft class, he's relatively close in age to the guys who have been drafted. He's already got three years in the league. So having that two or three years, only being 23 years old, and kind of looking at where he fits in this draft class if we're making this move. You know, we have to weigh what we're giving up for what we're getting back. We're going to have a, a year. We can pick up the option if we needed to. I mean, Samir, does that make sense to you? Yes, he's still under his rookie contract. What is it that we need to do to help him get to that next level? Just play within the scheme. Take what's given to you. Don't try and make every throw. Um, just live to see the next down and it'll come. I mean, that's the thing with Christian in the backfield. I mean, You, get a, you have a real weapon back there. You have Robbie and DJ outside. Robbie getting vertical. They were they looked very comfortable, you know, in the past when they were together. So I think there is a connection. Panthers receiver Robbie Anderson verbringt die Offseason in Florida. Lily, this is where I started at 22. And Lily, that's how I got in here. This clown, man, this clown. Carry this clown. This is a picture of me. This my this my freshman year, my freshman jersey. Look how big my jersey was, man. This two X. <laughs> These like some of my touchdowns with Sam from the Jet days. Bei den Jets fing Anderson bereits zwei Jahre lang die Pässe von Sam Donald. That was when we had that, that touchdown against the Cowboys for 92 yards. It was a big play. That was a touchdown. That's a touchdown. That was, and then that was against the Raiders. But yeah, a lot of memories playing for the for the Jets, man. But yeah, that's got some work to do in here, but that's that. Sam Darnold, the Jets starting quarterback for the last several years, is now headed to the Carolina Panthers. The two teams have agreed to terms. Yes. What up? How'd it go this morning? It's good. Early. Yeah. How's it going? Good to see you. Good to see you. Go ahead and grab a seat right yeah. there. Yeah, right. So. 
Uh, hey, Joe. What's up, my brother? How you doing? Good to meet you. Yeah, man. good to meet you as well. In einem der schwächsten Teams der Liga hatte Donald es schwer, gut auszusehen. Der Wechsel nach Carolina ist seine Chance zu beweisen, dass er ein echter Anführer ist. You know, coming in as a Carolina Panther, I'm very excited, very excited for this opportunity and uh, just to, you know, come in, you know, with a with a fresh start and, uh, you know, just excited, excited to get going. Looking forward to moving in pretty soon. Close. Making it feel like home already, so it's good. Obviously, I'm still unpacking. A um, ton of furniture still hasn't come, but waiting on that the next couple weeks. But I got the TV ready to be set up, but obviously got to place it somewhere. So I think that's kind of what I'm most excited about, to be able to get the living room finished and a nice rug there too. So I actually got this thing. Obviously, I haven't used it yet. I got it yesterday. It's a great place to be able to, you know, learn the playbook. You know, I learn better being able to draw things, especially if it's bigger. I'm excited to use it here pretty soon. Some people wouldn't think that it would remind them of California, but Charlotte really remind me of, you know, kind of where I grew up. So, and I know when my family comes out here and visits me and my friends, it's going to feel like home to them, and that'll be really cool. It's good to be here, and um, you know, once the furniture gets here and you know I get settled in, I think that'll be. Um, you know, when it starts to feel real. Der Trade für den neuen Quarterback setzt ein Karussell in Gang. 2020 war Teddy Bridgewater Spielmacher der Panthers. Jetzt gibt es ein Angebot für ihn von den Denver Broncos. Bridgewater ist beliebt und hat eine lange Verletzungsgeschichte. Niemand möchte ihm Steine in den Weg legen. Hey, George. Hey, I'm sitting here with uh, Mr. Tepper, Coach Roll. And so, we just want to go through this. Here's what we can do. George, we'll do seven. And for the sixth round pick, that we start this conversation out. How about our guy? Okay. Well, you love Teddy. We love Teddy. So, we want to do what's right for him. We, we could hold him until June 1st. So, I think this, get it. this, is, a, this, is, a, this is a win win for everybody. So. Yeah, this is done yeah. a little bit for Teddy. Yeah, that's the bottom line. We have breaking news, ladies and gentlemen. We have a quarterback trade, and it is shaking up potentially the top 10. Teddy Bridgewater is going to Denver. Really, the issue was not the draft pick compensation. It was simply about how they were going to break down the financials. Carolina will pay a portion of Bridgewater's salary, gives Carolina some flexibility in terms of their salary cap in both 2021 and 2022. The Panthers now have Financieller Spielraum für ein starkes Team um Running Back Christian McCaffrey und Sam Donald. All right, guys, good job today. Got a good one. Yes, indeed. I'm der erste Tag des Drafts ist Geschichte. Morgen wollen die Panthers ihre Defense weiter verbessern und neue Waffen für den neuen Quarterback holen. Get on the field for us, year one, have a role. Chuba, I mean, I agree with, with Jeff there. I think the guy makes the difference, you know, and he comes in and spells Christian and, you know, allows you to be multiple and do different things, you know. Got a high high ceiling. Tommy Tremble, we know there's a lot of conviction from our uh, coaching staff on how to use him. It'd be nice, I think we can go back and get him. All right, guys, good job today. Oh, yeah, congrats, great pick. Congrats to you guys. Scott Fitterers Telefon klingelt an diesem Wochenende hunderte Male. Oft wollen die Anrufer Draftpicks tauschen. Nach dem Prinzip, du lässt mich an deiner Position in Runde 2 ziehen, dafür gebe ich dir zwei Picks in Runde 4. The Carolina Panthers have traded the 39th pick to the Chicago Bears. Zahlt sich diese Taktik des Managers aus? Er und Trainer Matt Rule wissen genau, wen sie wollen. Marshall 
Wer ist noch verfügbar, wenn die Panthers das nächste Mal an der Reihe sind? Oder sollten sie hochtraden, um ihren Wunschspieler zu bekommen? Tackle Brady Christensen wäre ein starker Beschützer für den neuen Quarterback in der Offensive Line. Wide Receiver Terrace Marshall könnte eine Alternative zu den etablierten Passempfängern sein. Oder liegen attraktive Angebote für den Pick der Panthers auf dem Tisch? That's why we want to lock it in for us. They can't, they can't lock it in. Okay. Okay. We'll stay Terrace Marshall. Terrace Marshall Jr. Gigantisches Talent. Viel Verletzungspech seit der Highschool. With the 59th pick in the 2021 NFL Draft, the Carolina Panthers select Terrace Marshall Jr. Wide Receiver LSU. Keep pounding. DJ Moore is already there. Robbie Anderson's there. Emotionen, die man außerhalb des amerikanischen Sports, außerhalb des Drafts, kaum erleben kann. Terrace. What's good, Coach? Oh, man, we're, we're excited to have you here. I know, uh, I know Will B is excited to have you here, but, but just know this, we all know what you can do. And you've, uh, you've battled through a lot to get to this moment, man. You've battled through some injuries. And you're here to come make plays for us and help us win a championship. So I got you. I probably need you everything like that. We're really excited to get you. Appreciate you. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, you you know you're gonna be fantastic. We're really really appreciate it. So, congr congratulations, okay? Yes, sir. Thank you. Right, we'll see you here tomorrow. If the Eagles call back, it's just one six round pick. Yes. I say we do it yes. with our next pick. But you want to go all line just to secure that. I mean, if the guy, if there's a guy there that we really want, right? Right. Remember, we had Brady Christensen, third round tackle, second round guard, though. So he's a good kid. If the Bengals come take. Brady Christians are going to trade six with the Eagles. With the 69th pick in the 2021 NFL Draft, the Cincinnati Bengals select Joseph Osai, linebacker, Texas. Who is it? Osai. Okay, do you want to do this? Yes. For 191? Yep, for 73 and 191. All right, we're calling it in. Ein Trade, diesmal nach oben. Und die Panthers bekommen ihren nächsten Wunschspieler. And then Carolina will choose as they made a trade with Philadelphia. With the 70th pick in the 2021 NFL Draft, the Carolina Panthers select Brady Christensen. With the 83rd pick in the 2021 NFL Draft, the Carolina Panthers select Tommy Trimble, tight end, Notre Dame. He can separate. This dude can really, really run, and he is a classic example of he's going to be a much better pro than what you saw in college. What's up, man? How you doing? Uh, I'm good. I'm good. I'm so excited you're going to be here. I got you. Uh, you've been one of my favorite guys all along. I love talking to you. And I can't wait to work with you. Yes, sir. Me too. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. Yeah, well, go enjoy the night, man. Make sure you take the night and thank everybody that helped you get here. And, uh, yes, sir. Of course. We'll get you here soon enough and get to work, okay? Can't wait, coach. Today is a big day. Are we ready to get going? All right, let's go. If we're looking for a steal, who's it going to be today in day three? 
Yeah, I believe it could be Chubal Hubbard, the running back out of Oklahoma State. Look for Chubal Hubbard to have a big impact early. Look, but our first pick, if we'd step our first pick would be Chuba, are you good with that or no? Are you, are you driving in today? That's what, that's what I yeah. thought it was going to be. So do we have anything alive on the table right now? No. Running back Chuba Hubbard. Mögliche Vertretung für Christian McCaffrey. Aber vielleicht ist er später noch verfügbar. Und die Panthers können noch mal tauschen. Für noch mehr Picks. Rich, one thing we're used to on draft weekend is the Seahawks trading back. It always happens. So now one of their top lieutenants, Scott Fitterer, goes to the Carolina Panthers, their new GM, and all he does is set the franchise record for most trades during a draft weekend. I wouldn't be surprised if they got more coming, Rich. Who is it? Do you guys want to do it? Yeah. Do you want to do it? I'm fine, I'm fine. Scott Fitterer und die Panthers haben die Chance, Hubbard zu draften. Ein alter Bekannter für Coach Matt Rule. Als College-Trainer war er oft sein Gegner. Hey, what's going on? I think we're going to pick. Julie texted me at 12.35. Will you please teach you? Oh, she loves him from the board? Let's close it. Turn it in. Good job. Die Textnachricht von Rules Ehefrau ist mindestens eine Entscheidungshilfe. Die Panthers holen Chuba Hubbard. Hello? Chuba. Yes, sir. Hey, it's Matt Allen with the Carolina Panthers. We're going to take you right here. Here's uh, Coach Rule wants to talk to you. Yes, sir. Thank you. What's up, man? You know, I couldn't sit there and watch you run wild on me all those years at Baylor and not take you when I had a chance. <laughs> Yes, sir. I appreciate it. Man, about 10 minutes ago, my wife texted me and said, please take Chuba Hubbard. So, <laughs> she speaks, it happens. We're excited to have you, man. Hey, here's our owner, yes, Mr. Sir. Tepper. Yes, sir. I got to tell you, you made it easy for the coach right now. <laughs> That's actually absolutely true story. Show me the text. <laughs> she said, you better come home and you better have you. Durch die vielen Trades hat Carolina spät im Draft noch einige Pfeile im Köcher. Scott, I think we have to take Nixon. Hmm? I think we have to take Nixon. Just, just, what do you think? I have no problem with that. We need bodies inside. What do you think now? I look at uh, Keith Taylor, the Washington corner. So you can match him up on the bigger receiver. He's got length and size. It's a big corner for me. Mike Martin had him there. You had him there. Big corner with the senior bowl. That was up. Es stehen noch diverse Spieler auf den Zetteln der Scouts, Trainer und des Managers. Ein Geheimtipp von Matt Rule, Longsnapper Thomas Fletcher. Ein sympathischer Spieler auf einer Position, die es meistens nur als undrafted Free Agent mit kleinem Vertrag in die NFL schafft. I like what they're doing in Carolina, trying to put it all together like that. Masterful. So we have two picks left, right? So if you had the rest of the guys in the floor, it would be no particular order. Phil Hawkins. Yep. Thomas Fletcher. Let's take Fletcher. Sure. And then come back and get that big body. This guy will call me the floor. What's up, bro? What's the other thing? He's just like a regular guy. This is Thomas. Hey, Thomas. This is Matt Allen with the Carolina Panthers. How you doing? I'm good, man. Hey, Coach Rule has a question for you. I'm gonna pass him. All right. All right. All right. Hey, Fletch, what's up, bro? What's up, brother? You coming or what? Uh, trying to figure it out right now. No, 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 no. I just drafted you. You coming or what? Are you kidding? Yeah, bro. No, you yeah. did not. Yeah. Welcome to. Carolina. Are you serious? Yeah, man. Welcome to Carolina Panthers. Dude, chill out, brother. <laughs> Thank you, brother. Yeah. Thank you. Here's what I'm gonna step for one. <laughs> Fletcher, you can be good at Carolina. Dude, let's go, baby. You ready? You ready? <laughs> oh, sports, are you kidding me? Am I ready? I'll walk my happy ass to Carolina right now, dude. You walking? Oh, I'll walk if you want me to. I'll call my hands and knees, bro. <laughs> we'll get you an escort here, okay? Golly, dude. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, Thank you're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Good to, good to have you. Thank you. So he, 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 that was the funniest damn car where he said, this kid was so excited, he said, I walked my damn ass up to him. <laughs> he was so surprised to get that car. Einen Pick haben die Panthers noch. Die Wahl fällt auf 140 Kilo Defensive Tackle Phil Hoskins von den Kentucky Wildcats. Hello? Hey, is this Phil? Yes, sir. Yes, it is. Hey, Phil, it's Matt Allen, Carolina Panthers. 
How you doing? I'm good, man. I got uh, Coach Rule here wanting to talk to you. All right. Phil. How you doing, Coach? I'm good, man. I'm good. Hey, we're going to take you right here, okay? Most definitely. We're excited to have you, man. We we watched the tape. We, uh, we're excited about who you are, excited about the way you play the game. You, you fired up? You ready? Most definitely am. <laughs> good. Good, man. Well, listen, we'll, uh, we'll uh, get you here as soon as possible. Welcome to Carolina. Welcome to Panther Nation. Hey, guys, I'm going to make this quick. First off, congratulations to a great draft. Cheers to that. I just want to say thank you to all of you for all of your hard work. It's been, it's been a long process, and uh, all of the hard work paid off tonight. We can't do it without all of you. i got to say a special thank you to Coach, my partner in this. I'm really excited about the future. To Mr. Tepper, couldn't imagine a better owner, better organization. So proud to be here. Thank you to all of you. Congratulations. Viele Träume sind in Erfüllung gegangen. Andere sind zerplatzt. Die Leben junger Menschen haben eine entscheidende Wendung genommen, weil sie von einem bestimmten Team gewählt worden sind. Weil Trainer, Manager und Besitzer etwas in ihnen sehen. Sie wollen sich jetzt beweisen und es im Sommer ins Team schaffen. Menschen mit Geschichten, die sie in der NFL erzählen werden.